Hi guys, welcome back to my diary channel. So, hi guys. Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to my diary channel. So, for today's video is really spontaneous. I'm not planning to do it actually. But, I just want to talk about happiness as you can see from the title. Okay, so I'm not, this video not will not be so long i just want to talk a little bit maybe for a few minutes is enough for me okay so hard talk i want to rename it as a late night talk actually but i usually sleep early so it's not suitable for late night talk so i rename it as a hard talk okay so um, if you guys are friend with me on my Instagram, I just posted a video that I asked an announcer from, from my friends on my Instagram regarding issue, not issue, regarding uh, a question um, about how to find our own happiness by not relying on something like maybe going out or eating nice food as you can see here Okay, sebelum semua mereka lebih panjang, help me to answer this question How to find our own happiness by not relying on something like going out or eating nice food Thank you guys Okay, so uh, I received uh, a few response from my friends but unfortunately I cannot post it here as my Instagram have a problem so I cannot retrieve back the response but I just remember a few response from my friends. Number one is laying on the bed for a whole day is I'm not mistaken. So, um, yeah, maybe it's, but for me, for my opinion, it depends on your situation. Maybe some, some day you want, you just want to lay on your bed by not doing nothing, but someday, you just feel tired by laying on the bed so it depends on you and then the second the second response is about i rephrase it because i don't remember the full sentence uh if you watching this video you can correct me if i wrongly rephrase your sentence okay so uh like having a dream and and just focus on how to achieve our dream okay i think like that so okay i trust i believe that in the way uh, in the way to to achieve our dream there will be a ups and down journey so my question is the point is what how not what how we gonna do to overcome the ups and down journey so that's the main point actually okay so the third response is from my friends also be grateful to Allah I think there is the the almost perfect answer because of whatever happens in our life just be grateful to Allah because just believe to Allah that every things happens every single things happen in our life there will be hikmah behind be so just be grateful to Allah but this is reality I'm not gonna say it is okay but this is the reality that not all of us have a different level of iman in trust on Allah I'm not gonna say it's okay actually we all of us have to put our 100% 200% trust on Allah but some of us, I believe, yes, I know that some of us not have the same level of Iman uh, because of, yeah, you know, you know what I mean, right? So, maybe at that time when they are having a different kinds of emotion, they cannot, they cannot just think about the good things. I, I think so. I don't know. Did you understand what I want? What I want to say? <laughs> okay, so actually, these things, uh, this issue, I I start to think about it um, two weeks ago when I watched a video from Najwa Latif 
that her sister Kaika said to her that mm, Najwa is not suitable yet to having a partner because of she herself yeah the still relying on something to find her own happiness like going out of I'm I think I'm the one same like Wawa too so if I'm stressed or, or I'm sad or maybe I have a different kind of emotion I want to go out I go maybe window shopping or just eating a nice food a good food my favorite food and also doing something like watching movie if I'm at I'm still at the same place that I'm stressed out so this gonna this will not help me I must go out so yeah I still thinking how I will find my own happiness my how I will be happy become happy if I'm not relying on something because of I believe that my roommates also like if she's stressed maybe in the midnight she will go down and coloring some of us will drawing some of us will listening to the music so it still depends on something that's my point it still depends on something they we have our own way to find to release the stress to overcome our kind of emotion that's my point so how can we become happy we change our mood by not relying on something so i hope you guys who watching this video can answer me if you guys have the answer i also dm wawa actually to find out what the answer from kaika but she's still not replying me but if you guys can help me notice her it's a it's good i'm so thankful for that and also if you guys also have a suggestion or answer you guys can slide to my DM on my Instagram. I'll put my Instagram here. Oh, you guys can also comment down below. I will read. I will appreciate it. Thank you very much. I love you all. As I said at the beginning of the video, I'm not talking so much. I'm not talking too long, but it's already long. Okay, so I'm so sorry, guys. <laughs> I'm not. I cannot stop talking. Mm, okay, yeah. Okay, what I discover is the first thing you need to do is sit down, cool down, and then relax, and then reflect. Only then you reflect, just think about why this thing happened. Maybe there will be a something good hikma that will be that happen to you will be hap will happen to you, and then. After your mind is like positive in a positive mood, positive vibe, only then you can think about the good things. Just be positive, keep your positive surrounding, keep, yeah, find your positive friends too. And then after that, you maybe can go out or maybe do something that suitable with you. I think that's all. As I said just now, if you have your suggestion, if you have your answer, you guys can slide to my DM and then you guys can also comment down below to help me and maybe you guys can help me to notice Wawa too. I think that's all from this video. I'm not planning to do it. I just wanted to do a hard talk. So I hope you guys are in a good way. Stay safe and then you are doing well in everything you do. Keep your momentum in Ramadan is semangat. And then I think that's all. Bye. Assalamualaikum. Spread love and be positive.